What the hell happened here? Becker, our xenobiologist. He was in debt with the company, with Price. I think she placed him here. He set the damn creature loose so she could steal the Otago. I handled it. That woman's a weasel. Should have quit long ago. Yes? Well, who's to say you've quit now? Who's to say you're not another spy? Ease down, Administrator. I don't feel like easing down. Look, Price tried to double-cross me, too. I'll do anything for a rematch. You have my word. The word of a Wayland yutani employee. And a professional killer at that. Yeah, what's the difference with that sergeant of yours? Do not bring Harper into this. I'm sorry. How's he doing? Not great. I have to check with Book... I mean, in the med bay. You know what? Go see him. But remember, you want to bring Price down, I can help you get into Pharaoh's Spire. It's got to be worth a try. Price is our only link to Cassandra, to the real Marlowe. But if you try anything, you go down with her. I'll keep that in mind, ma'am. Hey, How's he doing? We managed to stabilize him. But without Bookard, I'm not sure for how long. Maybe we should just put him in cryo sleep already and get the hell out of here. Not until I get Cassandra from Marlowe. Harper needs his daughter. Do you really think she's out there? Is she even alive? She is. I'll find her. Stern offered his... help. That mercenary? Can we trust him? Seems that Price knows where Cassandra is. And I don't see how we could get into Pharaoh's Spire without him. Not much of a choice, huh? <laughs> I hate to say it, but you're getting better at this. Corrigan told me how you handled the critter. <whistles> Ballsy move. I did what I had to do. Administrator Hayes? Are you up to going after Price? What if I'm not? Don't worry. I'll be in the APC, keeping an eye on Stern. All right, then let's do this. For Harper. Yes. For Harper. Everyone listen. I know you won't trust a Merc, but I'm sure you'll trust Hayes, right? She'll be riding with me in the APC. And maybe you can trust a former Marine. That's right. I did six tours with the USCM, including the Tiensum campaign. So you don't have to worry about me. I'm a tough cookie. Worry about Cassandra and everyone Marlowe has imprisoned. We need the location of his base. So we're going to get it out of price. The worst boss I ever had the pleasure to work with. I hope no one fancied the career of Wayland Yutani, because this will kill your chances good and hard. without being shredded by the Spire's anti-air turrets. This is as far as I go. Copy that. Marines, we'll have to make final approach through the street. Lots of nooks and crannies, so keep your eyes open for hostiles. Together we can fix this. Together? After all these deaths? If memory serves me right, you largely contributed to these casualties, Maiko. You activated the Cerberus Protocol, correct? I did. I had to. Right! You did it because you understand. You understand the companies and the general interest are one and the same. Marla was right. Well before he went crazy, that is. The things he found in that mine. What they could mean for pharmaceutics, space travel, security. The applications are virtually limitless. I wouldn't want any of that. Then think about the revenues these creatures represent. Imagine, 
Space stations, a hundred times bigger and safer than Pioneer. So in the end, that's what this is about? Money? Numbers? How could you be such a machine? Really? Oh, not you, Maiko. Spare me the whistleblower lecture, will you? Who do you think I am? A synth? <laughs> Excuse me? A synth. I've pretty much built this world. You really think a synth would have handled half of what I've done on Leafy? It all makes sense now. What? Maiko, listen. Your assessments. Your poise. Two of your teams left for dead. Your extensive knowledge of the station. Of the atmospheric processors. I'm the damn director of that rock. Don't you get it? And yet, you couldn't stop that protocol. Would you listen to me? Everything out there, it's mine. I could have saved these people. But you didn't. So much power, and you did nothing with it. Except protecting the assets of this fucking company. We could have talked. Harper. He would have welcomed you on board. But you didn't think of that, did you? You didn't think of your own life. Not a single time, right? Do you think a human would do that? Maiko. These assets? Marlowe's research? I don't have it anymore. It's all uploaded somewhere on the Otago. Burn it. Print it. Sell it to Siegson or the UPP for all I care. But take me with you. Please. Cassandra, where is she? Is she even alive? Do you have that stored somewhere in that carbon processor of yours? Stop it! I am not a synth. <sighs> Look, she's probably with all their prisoners. In their city, below Old Divai. A city? Marlowe's lair. Ancient and alien. God, he was so obsessed with that place. And then he became obsessed with her. He wouldn't keep Cassandra anywhere else. Now please, take me with you! No. Maiko! Look at me! I'm not a synth! I doubt you're human either. Maiko? Listen to me! I'm not a fucking synth! I am not a synth! I'm not a synth! <laughs>